to show you how you can get the tutorial bag with the hell I get the tutorial bag on. Like you see your makeup. So, all you're gonna do is, you're gonna go to your wrapper phone on wrapper off one. You're gonna go to your page.gs file. And while you're on it, you are going to copy the HTML file. You're going to copy this file from my Beyond Studio LVM, which is not done yet. But I will make it public though. So, sorry for the private visibility. change it okay this one has changed to public so you can get some stuff on it to put on your lap walk wall I went out to your lap way so what I go do is it gonna go to the static folder page.js if you want preview window, you're going to go to the page we are on studio.js. And this is for people who only want the Atlanta tutorial to display once. So basically, you're going to copy this HTML file. You're going to copy the entire HTML like that. Okay. You got to copy it from the top or the bottom. You could just do it from the top. Just to make it faster. And you're gonna do it until you get all the way up here, okay? And then you're gonna copy the file, you're gonna see the file. But if you want this file, you're gonna have to tweak the tile off of it. Don't worry, it won't break anything. I'll show you proof. So I open up the Fion Studio application, edit the video, and would have you have a source for it. You can see it works. And if you check my walks, like if you work with walks. You can see that the app is going well and there's no problems because I did something successful because I deleted the tile thing without deleting the tile thing. And if you, want, if you want to remove the debug button, you have to paste all this. You have to copy this, flash forwards, you have to remove the debug. I recommend you not do that. Because you're going to want to see what your videos go going to look like. So I recommend you not add this. Sorry to add, it's just for old. Or if you don't know how to do it, you can copy this entire thing, which is, just, which is designed not to break your app. So if you can copy this, which is designed to not break your app. Because I did this very carefully. But the tile only and not doing anything else with it. And then you can paste it on your page.js file over here. You got your code full. You know all that. But if you ended up pasting, if you, if you ended up copying this with slash this as A on it, you can change this to say slash go full. And it will still work. Now, if you want, if you want the tutorial to display every single time you open, open up a video maker, you're going to go to your static, go to your info, the and then you're going to edit the file and all the go for section up here. And or right here on a never display function, you're going to delete never and replace it with a display. Don't worry, it's not going to break it. All it's going to do is 
show the airline tutorial. I'll show you proof. That's not gonna break it. So, when I go to my gold search pool over here, it does everything I'm supposed to do, like the roads are beyond. Bang. The roads are beyond. Yep, and the airline tutorial displays. And you guys make them a break it. Don't worry about it, because I'll explain further. So if you want to skip this toy, just click on skip for now. And we'll bring up this pop-up. If you upload to your videos, if you want to fix that, again, you're going to go to info.json. You're going to copy this. Like I said, you're going to edit this to say as well as pages as well as HTML slash list.html That's what you're going to do Go to the editing And see It doesn't break it All it's doing is displaying the tutorial It's not doing anything See, you can still preview your video Except you have to save it first And if you want to refresh your video maker. Okay, it gets crashed on me, okay? Hold up. You will be on. Beyond, 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 beyond. So if you want to refresh with the tutorial, you click this down here, and right below debug, you're going to click on Interactive Tutorial, and then, if you want to start it, it's going to take you to a video maker slash full. Well, in order to fix that, you're going to copy this over here, you're going to copy the video maker slash full, again, it's still the same. Nothing to be seen down here. It will just redirect you to the studio. Well, because I added this code right here. I added this code, which allows me to go to the tutorial. Now, before you ask, if you want the themes, I don't think it's possible because you don't want to be adding too many like stuff. So, instead, you're just going to do the Omega Slash 4 and then replace with Go Fold. And, you want to bring your theme, you go go to the static, page.js, and the file. And then, you're going to copy this. Or if you want to add it like that, you could just do, you just copy here, like. Right here, you're going to put on that tray and custom. That's going to work for theme. If you don't do that, the first studio will probably won't work. So you need the tray in order to work the studio. Otherwise, if you don't have it, it will break it. So you want to make sure that you, all, that you have to always add this. Otherwise, it will break the studio. And you don't have to delete this if they ask it. I don't know why that's there, but just don't do it just in case. And you wanna change the watermark. Just a simple tutorial, you wanna change the watermark. You could go over here, place it, and put everything you want. It could be two lines, G4S, free trial. And it works like this. It looks like this. You want two walls, so you go type this over here. You want to try to type here. J for us, right here. 
this year. I got official parking. It's just my Walmart right there. I don't even know why that says it. That, that doesn't exist at all. I just don't know why. I mean, I've been doing really good with this. Oh, um, it's not done, if you're asking. Yep. And there you go, guys. That's how you get your air like a toy to display. Don't you dare make fun of me, otherwise, I'll block you. Because what I'm doing does not play for studio. I'm trying to be super careful. Try to be careful to not break it. So, yep. Just try to be careful. And also making sure the voices don't break. Because if that breaks, you won't be able to use it anymore. So, yeah, I'm trying to make sure that the files you're using does not break the TTS voices while the video is playing. While for a preview window, the that issue will get fixed. I mean, it was working before, but I think it broke. But don't worry, I'll try to fix it again. This is me signing off.